Look at my stuff, isn't it neat? Hi everyone, I'm Kiki. Welcome back or welcome to my channel. Today I have a video about my Burberry Bear collection. So if you're interested in all of that, please keep watching. Let's get started. Do -de -do -de -do 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 -de -do -de -do -do Welcome to Kiki's channel. Do -do. Ding ding. Here is my box that I keep all my Burberry Bear keychains in. It's actually just a plain black net a porter box that I got years ago from ordering something, and it's just super useful and the perfect size to keep my collection in. Ta da! All right, so this is my entire collection of Burberry Thomas Bears. I really like this classic style of bear. I know that in the last few years, they've actually changed the style that they make this bear in, and I'm not a big fan of it, so I actually haven't collected any of those. So these ones are all from a few years ago when I still enjoyed the style of bear and the clothing that they did for them. So let's start off with the classic Thomas Bear. I actually don't own the super classic one where he's just plain um, with a bow tie. I have one similar and I'll show you that in a sec, but let's start with this one. This guy is one of the classic Thomas Bears. He's wearing the classic Burberry trench. And if you look close up, you can see that he has the little clasp detail there. The button has Burberry written on it. I apologize, there may be a lot of dog barking in the background. It's Moon Puff and Hershey as usual. I apologize for that but here we go. I love him. He's super classic and very easy to match just because he's very neutral. And very similar to him I have another guy but he actually has a little hat on whereas my previous one didn't. And he is also wearing the exact same style of Burberry coat. However, he has his coat in a plaid material, the Burberry plaid, which is super cute. And of course his button also says Burberry on it. The gold hardware on his little, what is this called, buckle is super cute. I love how it's tied like this. They're adorable. They can sit, but because of the weight of the keychain at the top of their head, it's hard to get them to actually sit properly. They look much better if you hang them like this with this kind of clasp here. I was mentioning earlier that I don't have the classic one, but essentially this is the same as the classic Burberry Bear, the plain one that you can get, but this one is in the rainbow version. And interestingly, it comes with a silver uh, toned hardware instead of gold. Anyway, back to the trench coats. There's another one in a trench coat, which I love. This trench coat is a little bit funkier than the other ones. Look at that armor on the side. Super cute, and I love the kind of red, green, blue tartan. Super cute, and on the back though of his collar, you can see that it still has the traditional Burberry material, Burberry plaid in the classic colors. Super cute, and just to give it a bit of that kind of punk era British vibe, it has a little pin. Let me see if I can focus. Pin that says Burberry on it. It's really adorable. So those are, I guess, my three kind of more plainish classic trench coat Burberry bears, Burberry Thomas bears. I will put them here. Here you guys can see them. Here are my here are my Thomas Bears in their trench coats. I have three of them in trench coats, I believe. Now, going along the same theme, I have a Thomas Bear here. I think I've named this one Kate. She's super adorable. I feel like she's a girl and her coat is just so cute. There's such something so adorable about this denim jacket. There's a little T for Thomas at the back or Teddy, um, Teddy Bear. The buttons, of course, all have Burberry on them. And there's these little motif kind of pins that she has there too, and a little T on her air. It's adorable. I really love this one. Next, I have this bear who's actually interesting because she's actually a pink material, my only true pink Burberry bear, and she's wearing this kind of poncho that's made out of leather. Very cute. Again, this button has Burberry on it. 
a more simple Thomas bear. Now this guy is super, super cool in my opinion. He is literally wearing gold toned hardware. He looks like a knight, knight in shining armor. And he's wearing a leather kind of overcoat um, vest right there. And it's quite hefty actually. He's not light, he's, he's quite heavy. And I just think he's so adorable. Look at that, it looks almost like dragon armor. Let me know in the comments below which bear is your favorite and if you also collect Burberry bears, I would love to know. Here is this guy. He's kind of a mint turquoisey green, super unique with buttons along the neck, kind of like a necklace or like a collar. And this kind of um, leather, I don't know what this is, kind of like a hat-ish hair thing that's coming out. I'm not really sure, but I just thought it was super funky and cute. There we go. Another one I think from the same series is this girl or guy over here. She's a soft, soft pink. Oh, I guess I lied. I thought this one was my only pink one, but this one's also pink. Hmm. But a different shade of pink. Like more, This one's more of like a sakura pink and the other one's more like almost like a, a bubble gum or like a hubba bubba kind of pink. Anyway, so back to this guy here. She has these cute little buttons on her, or not buttons, they're like mm, kind of like fake gemstones sewn onto her as well as these kind of, uh, um, what do you call these guys when they're like, they're kind of like buttons but they're like pierced in. But anyway, these decorative pieces, she's super funky and it's all around the top here too. So cute. Ooh, and down the back. Now this girl is so special. I love that shade of kind of, it's a slightly framboise, kind of like a raspberry red, like a pink toned cool red. And her skirt is like a tutu, a leather tutu, mind you. And actually the reverse color inside is kind of like a faux snake print with a kind of mustard yellow color on the outside. And the gemstones on this bear are super shiny and glittery. It is so, so cute. It looks like she's just a little ballerina. I know I mentioned this earlier in the video, but in case you guys are jumping in at this point, please let me know if you guys have any favorites. Let's start with my three guys over here, my furry brothers. So this guy over here has a funky blue mohawk. I feel like this is like super punk British kind of vibes. At least that's what I think. Wearing a leather jacket studded with these kind of silver pieces. It is so nice and it's of course real leather. Here we go, the back. He's just so cute. <laughs> And actually this guy's one of my very favorites. He is like, I don't know, like a, a monster Thomas, like a super fuzzy version. He's like, I think there's like, sh this is shearling on the side. And he's just so fluffy. He is super adorable. I wish I got him in more colors. And he kind of has that same mohawk thing going on down the back, like a skunk almost. <laughs> and then we're this kind of more tealy blue on the side and on his legs. His paws are blue, same with the bottom here. And he has this kind of shiny metallic bow tie. He's super adorable and he's just so, he feels so nice in the hand. He's just so squishy and soft. So cute, love this guy. And then my last of the hairy Thomas bears is this skunky boy. I think this one, ooh, I forget which designer it was a collaboration with. I wanna say Tom Ford, but I'm probably getting it wrong. I don't remember who. But um, this was a collaborative piece and there's a piece of art. Maybe you guys will remember who this guy is. I forget, who was it? Oof, I don't remember. But anyway, it's a super cute piece. He kind of looks like a skunk to me. He's adorable. He has a bit of um, uh, this jacket is meant to be open like this. This is a nylon kind of bomber jacket, which is kind of neat. And it has a bit of a detail on the cuffs or sorry, on the arms here. And obviously on the back. 
and he also has silver hardware. So I think I have three of them with silver hard, or three or four of them with silver hardware, and the rest are all in gold. So this guy, this guy and this guy here. These guys have silver hardware and the rest of them have gold. All right, so these are my last three. I'll start with this guy. He really, really gives, like I said before, that kind of Vivian Westwood, punk era, London, British vibe. And I love the air pieces that he has on this ear as well as the safety pin over here and here has a little button that says Burberry 1856 hopefully that shows up well and on the back side it has and on the back side it says Burberry again London England a pin that goes right across his belly ouch but it's a really big one. And of course, again, it says Burberry on the side and a cute little suede feeling bow. He is super funky. I love him. And look at the colors of his tartan. All right, next I have these two guys. First off, my police officer. Love this hat. It has a leather piece that goes down as well as a collar, a white collar that kind of is pretty stiff and stands up. Here we go. This is embroidered on in kind of a metallic gold thread. He has a very cute kind of soft navy, kind of marine color to him. The hat up here is plushy, so it's been stuffed. And he's just really cute. I like it. And my last and one of my favorites, though it's so hard to choose favorites because they're all so cute is this guy here oh my gosh one of the queen's guards with his kind of bare fur top hat and a gold chain that just goes under his chin i don't know there's something so adorable about this i like stop like it is so cute and of course the buttons on his belly say burberry on them he's this gorgeous shade of kind of like a true red and just so so cute i love this little guy he's so cute What do you guys think? Do let me know what you think of my collection, guys. Let me know if you have any favorites, if you collect Burberry Bears yourself, or Thomas Bears, I mean. Um, do you guys collect them in the keychain version, or do you guys collect them uh, in the larger versions? I would love to know. And if you have any tips or tricks on how to get really cute ones, I would love to hear from you too. If you have any questions about my collection or any of the bears, do let me know in the comment box below and I'll be happy to answer those questions. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell button to be notified whenever I upload new videos. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Janet. Ding, ding. Do 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 do. Thanks for watching. Come again. Bye bye.